Aduans is where you have the ability to both custom modify your cabinetry as well as add on your individual accessories. As an example of this, let's move down to our wall with our cabinets with the glass doors. This cabinet, if I right click on it, the wall 3336, GL means glass door, I'll scroll down the attributes and let's take a quick view. You'll notice that I have a glass door cabinet, but I don't have a finished interior. If your supplier offers the ability to finish interiors on cabinetry, you'll be able to go to add-ons and it will be part of the list. In this case, it's in the category called wall modifications. I'll click on the plus to open this up and then I'll look down the list until I find finished interiors. I'll put a check mark next to finished interiors in the box and you'll see I've now finished the interior on my cabinet. Maybe you wanted to apply another option, such as, um, let's say, a grooved back panel. If I click on it, the back panel is now grooved. Now, if we zoom in on this, you can see that the back panel is grooved. To make it um, a little more apparent, we'll right-click on it, and we'll go into the texture and line mode there just for a moment, and you can see the detail. What else can we do? Well, this cabinet might have a working door on the end, so we'll come down and say left side, let's put a working door on it. Or maybe even add an accessory to the base, such as an appliance garage. We'll click on pluses, we'll go to the appliance garages, and let's choose the straight 18-inch appliance garage. And there you go. That quickly, you've added both modifications as well as individual accessories. The items that you see in the list to my right come directly from the catalogs. So if your manufacturer offers certain products, they will be there. And if they don't offer that option or product, they will not be part of that list. It is completely based on your manufacturers, your suppliers, product offerings. Let's take a quick look at what we've done. So we will center back. We will go back to perspective for a moment. And if I could just point one thing out before we move on, see where it says mode, see where it says texture with edges. I'm going to click view. I'm going to click on that wall and let's do a little different drawing. We're going to do a texture with edges drawing which shows both graining on the cabinetry, texture on the countertop, but also goes back and places the thin lines around all the profiled edges. This is one of my favorite ways to view drawings.